Do you ever wonder how you're going to get through another strenuous and weary day? Are you tired of the rat race and just hoping to make it to the end of your life unscathed? Let me give you some exhilarating news. Hang in there, God has something great in store for you. In Genesis 5, Enoch did not die, but walked with God right into heaven. God was saying, I've got something great in store for you. When the prophet Elijah raised a widow woman's little boy from the dead in 1 Kings 17, God was saying, I've got something great in store for you. In the 2 Kings 4, the prophet Elisha raised a Shunammite's boy back to life. God was saying, I've got something great in store for you. In John 11, when Jesus raised Lazarus from the dead, God was giving away the secret. And on Sunday morning, after his only begotten son was crucified and put in a sealed tomb, God decided it was time to open the gift. In Jesus Christ is the free gift of eternal life. And this gift is more than we could ever have hoped for because this gift includes the actual resurrection of our physical bodies to everlasting life. In Job 19 verses 25 to 27, Job proclaimed, I know that my Redeemer lives and that in the end he will stand on the earth. And after my skin has been destroyed, yet in my flesh I will see God. I myself will see him with my own eyes, I and not another. Job is overwhelmed with excitement as he repeats himself, I myself will see him with my own eyes, I and not another. This is the gift freely offered to everyone who places their faith and trust in Jesus Christ. Beloved, as you grapple with the issues of life from day to day, don't give in to discouragement. Remember, in Jesus Christ, God has something great in store for you. This is Lane Wilder for Carry the Light Ministries, bringing you insights from an elder.